Uh, hi, Missy. Yeah, it's a good evening, eh? That's my girl. That's my girl. Yep. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. What was that? <laughs> what was that? Hey. You're funny. You're funny. I'm telling you. What a cutie. What a cutie. Anyhow, that's Missy. My best friend. <laughs> okay, kiddo. Talk to you later. I like these signature knocks, you know, they have a little bump on them so that you can tell which way your cock feather is facing. You can do it all by feel. is made out of Pacific U. So it's North American. It's a lovely wood to draw, very smooth. Okay, my friends, so that's our bananas all shot off. Anyhow, this bow, yeah, 72 inches long, 43 pounds at 28 inches. Knock set five eighths of an inch above 90. It has a little reinforcement in here, but you can see that it's also quite worn. It's been shot quite a bit. It's not slowing down at all. Now the bow costs $1,100, and now I, I see the ones that they're making are uh, 15, $1,570 for a bow like this. So they're not uh, inexpensive. But uh, it's a great tradition, and uh, I certainly enjoy it. Uh, anyhow, there's Eb the longbow. So you can see that uh, longbow shoots just fine. There's our possum. We've got you know a nice little group there. Of course, some of the arrows they hang down, but that doesn't mean that they're not right in the center. Anyhow. Hope you enjoyed that and you got something out of it. Relax those fingers. <laughs> okay, boys, have a good night. Bye now. Well, my friends, let's do something a little different this evening. Um, Manfred Groth was asking, what else did I do? Because I showed you the little axe that I had made. And uh, I want to make it clear that Every Scandinavian was not really a Viking in the sense that they were warriors. Yes, we had warriors, but most people made a living at the sea, fishing, or in the lumber woods. They were carpenters, they could build houses, they could build barns, they could build boats. But I thought that I would show you this. This is a jigger. I made this on my forge. It's two pieces of wire 
and they've got a little barb on them. And this part here is made out of lead, and you could just shine it with your file a little bit, and it would shine like a, a sardine. And then the codfish would come after it, and uh, you would catch them. So it was a jigger. You just put it down, pull it up on a string, just like so. And of course, if it hooked a fish, well, you caught the fish. So this is the way that a great majority of our ancestors made a living by using a jigger. And uh, that's what I thought I'd show you. So it's not just daggers and swords and battle axes. You had to make a living and fishing was a great one. We did a lot of trade with the Angles and the people in Northern Europe. And uh, anyhow, that's just something that I'd show you, okay? Okay, talk to you later.